here. This man is not insane. He has never been in any institution whatsoever. He's as sane as all of you people watching television right at this moment. And he does have a name. His name is Max. Max who, you ask? That's all you need to know at present. You know, this man is not crazy because there's a fine line between insanity and being a genius. This man is a genius. He's just different than anything that you've ever seen in Mid-South and all the opposition. I want you to know one thing. He could cause all of you to have split personalities because this man is tenacious. As I've said before, he is not crazy and he does have a name. It's Max. And that's all you need to know right now. This event is for one fall or remaining television time. In the red corner at 252 pounds from parts unknown, the missing link. And in the blue corner, at 238 pounds from Tennessee, Johnny Rich. Well, we heard Akbar regarding the missing link, and now we heard the introduction. We'll see him in action. The missing link versus Tennessee's popular star, Johnny Rich. Jim? Oh, boy, General Skandar Akbar made it very clear that this man has got all his oars in the water, so to speak, that he's not insane, that his name is Max, and he said that's all we need to know right now. So we have learned a little bit about the missing link. He's a very unorthodox individual, as you can see right there. The missing link at 252 pounds. Johnny Rich and the missing link laying those forearms, those club-like forearms into the chest of Johnny Rich. The missing link, a tremendous physical specimen. General Akbar says this man is sane. This man has never been in a mental institution. That leads one to think that uh, there's, there's some clouds hanging over the pass of the missing link. Well, he's in there against a, a great young athlete and Johnny Rich, a cousin of Tommy Wildfire Rich. And the missing link has got his hands full today, so this should be a great test for both athletes. Not only Johnny Rich, who wants to get a win right here on national television, but the mysterious and unorthodox missing link, who may or may not be associated with General Skandar Akbar. Inside drop kick cradled by Johnny Rich, the link, those tremendous, the tremendous strength in his legs, kicking out very, very quickly. Flying body press by Rich, but the link gets out of that. The man has got a tremendous amount of dexterity, and now Johnny Rich, who is not intimidated whatsoever by this man, not intimidated whatsoever by this man, atomic smash. Johnny Rich has turned it on, is coming on like a house of fire against the missing link. Akbar says his name is Max, and Max just pulled off a maneuver there that a miscalculation by Johnny Rich right into the kidney area, a very dangerous area, a very dangerous area, a tender area. The link going on the second rope, it's a legal maneuver off the second rope, a headbutt to the kidney area, a headbutt to that lower back and kidney area. Now the link cradling the leg. And that's all, that's all she wrote. Rick Ferreira for counts Rich. one, two, three. The missing link gains the victory over Johnny Rich. For the referee, the link has attacked Johnny Rich after the bell. That's an automatic disqualification in Mid-South, but the link doesn't care. The link doesn't care if he gets his hand raised or not, apparently. There is the decision. He's reversed it. Referee Rick Ferreira attacked after the bell by the missing link. The winner is Johnny Rich. We still have time, so we'll see the junkyard dog in action when we return.